By now, if you're in the real estate industry, you have a TV or read the Seattle Times, then you know that house prices are going up and inventories are coming down. But what that really means is that there's a lot more buyers than sellers right now. And even the most aggressive house hunter may have a hard time actually getting that home they want under contract and closed. In fact, the Seattle Times reported that inventories are the lowest they've been since 2006 and buyers want to buy but they can't find a house. Plus, there's less than two months of inventory in most places. Check out this chart of inventories. So the green lines here represent the amount of properties that were on the market back in April 2011 in the 8,000 range and currently in the low 5,000 range. And you can see down here in the blue, this is the amount of buyers that are coming into the market. So we were in the 1800 range, dropped down to 1300. Now we're back in the 21 to 2200 range. So if you have a drop in inventory and an increase in buyers, that creates a seller's market. Now coming up are the five things you or your friends or your clients can do to get your offer accepted and buy the home of your dreams without spending more money. I'm Ben Brashen. And I'm Ryan Leopold and welcome back to Mortgage Resource TV. So buying a house in this competitive market is hard. Uh, there's a high demand coupled with the lowest interest rates we've ever seen. But Ben, that doesn't mean you have to break the bank to get the home of your dreams. Here's the top five ways you can improve your chances of buying your home without spending more money. Number five, write a love letter to the seller of the house. But Ryan, not a love letter like you probably once wrote your elementary school sweetheart about how you like, like them. This letter should be heartfelt about you and your family and why you want the house and how you could see yourself living there. Or that little Johnny has already picked out his room. I mean, that really helps you connect with the seller in an emotional way that can get you the house over maybe an investor. Yeah. And number four, send the seller a family photo. Dogs, cats included, but Christmas pictures definitely discouraged. By sending a photo over, you'll prove to the seller, well, you're a real person in the flesh who will take care of their home. But really avoid naked, costume, or even religious photos or anything else that could offend someone. Smiling faces, kids and pets are some of the things that just about everyone loves. Number three, get a spinach eating, Popeye-like, strong pre-approval from a reputable local lender. Right, now what we mean here is don't waste your time getting a pre-approval letter from a lender who doesn't check your credit, income and assets. Nowadays, sellers, or at least a really good listing agent, will call your lender to see just how qualified you are. And number two, once you get that Popeye Strong pre-approval letter, encourage a listing agent to call and engage with your lender. Now, of course, you can only encourage the listing agent to call your lender if you know your lender has your back and they'll answer their phone. A good listing agent knows who will close loans in this market and who can't. And number one, if you want a house rather than just a contract that never closes, be an active buyer and maintain the relationship with the professionals you started with. With rates at all time lows, hard refinances, FHA streamlined loans, multiple offers, rising house prices, falling inventory, tightening loan guidelines, and the entire real estate industry pretty much at capacity like I'm out of breath, trying to bargain shop on the cost of doing business at the last minute with discount real estate brokers, mortgage lenders, or inspectors can eliminate your dream home from reality faster than a Marshawn Lynch breakaway touchdown. So I'm telling you guys, this information is really helpful, especially in a competitive market we're in today. And also, if you find this information to be of value, please comment, share, Facebook, Twitter, forward, or anything else you can do to help us help the people who are in need. Plus, the next month, we'll start a huge contest for people who share or comment on our videos, including Diamond Club tickets, VIP concert access, and rounds of golf at some of the most exclusive courses in the state. That's right. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time on Mortgage Resource TV. Here's the top five ways to improve your chances of buying the home you want. Wait, this is a little inventory. bossy. Check out this chart on inventory. Let me just say that. Check out this chart. Check out this short on inventory. I don't know what you want me to say.